Yay. Hello, everyone. Welcome to another Q&A. This time, what's the occasion? Oh, how did that happen? Seriously, yo, thank you guys so much. I, 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 I this is unbelievable. I can't believe we're actually at 6,000 subs. Um, actually, it's like 6.01, whatever numbers. But yeah, in celebration, we're gonna do a, a little short Q&A, uh, from what I, I posted on my community tab, so, uh, let's get to it. Sorry, I'm in a good mood. I, uh, just got done doing a Skylander stream, that, and I saw the trailer for Despicable Me 4, and it actually goes hard. What? Anyways, questions. Alright, the first one from Ace Plush Productions. Question number one, will you be doing more fan model plushies? And to answer that, yeah. I have a lot of ideas for making plushies. I want to make more uh, fan game characters like uh, Pop Goes, like, or not Pop Goes, like characters from Pop Goes, from Five Nights Candies, uh, maybe some more Joy Creation ones, but uh, yeah, who knows? I might also make some more, some like SFM fan models if they interest me, but who knows? Second, do you ever plan on selling any of your plushies? I thought of it, and I'm still in the process of thinking about it. Um, the only problem is, uh, the, uh, hang on. Like, the original Letty Mech, I would sell this thing if it wasn't covered with hair, and I would wash it. It's just I don't trust putting this, like, five-year-old plush in the dryer. So, I'm still thinking about it. From Cupcake Plush Productions. Three questions. Who are your top five favorite and least favorite FNAF characters? I've explained this for many Q&As over the years, but uh, it always changes from time to time. Uh, I, I can at least give you my top five favorite. Um, Springtrap, Freddy, Foxy, Baby, and Bonnie. I still like Chica. She's cool. Least favorite? I really don't have a lot of least favorites. Actually, no, there's quite a few. I mean, you got the rainbow, you got Dee Dee, you got Balloon Boy, you got... Yeah, no, I, I those are just the ones I could think of. Number two, what's your favorite game slash game series outside of FNAF? Ooh, that's a good one. Probably Skylanders, either that or like Resident Evil. I've been really getting into that re recently. But a really good indie horror game that I have played recently, Shipwreck 64. Best indie, indie horror game of 2024. Trust me. And number three, if you could change one thing about your YouTube career, uh, what would it be? I wish I would do more plush series other than FNAF plush. Um, like, maybe like a Bendy series, a Cuphead series, something like that. Like, the plushies I have characters for, for, for series, like, stuff like that. But, you know, it's also due to my interests and stuff like that. But I, not, I really wouldn't change much about uh, my uh, YouTube career. From uh, Pumpkin Jack, Pumpco Jack, I, 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 I'm i sorry, YouTube is being dumb. Uh, question for the Hotel Gang from Season 5, how's business? Business is booming, thanks to Freddy and Baby. Yeah, we're totally not filling in for the other characters just because they're in stores in another house. Anyways. Yeah, no, it's, uh, it, business is booming, just like, uh, Radiator Springs and cars, and, uh, anyways, I'm, I'm gonna go and eat some chocolate. Hey, wait for me! Well, that was weird. Question for, uh, for me. Well, what would you rate your big bads, uh, from best to worst? Ooh, that's actually a good one. Uh, how about I go backwards? So, worst? Scorch, because I did not like that. Um... Let me think. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking of uh, villains from like each season. Um, or at least big bads. Um, uh, maybe Vincent Fourth Place. Um, actually no, Red Bear. It would be actually no, it would be Scorch, Red Bear, from season the other half of season seven. Uh, Vincent, even though I know people like that character, I d that just came out of, like, pure, like, I don't know, it, 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 I don't know, some things didn't really sit well with me with that character, but, eh, whatever. People like him, it was an interesting character arc for Freddy and all that, and I, I, that's all I really wanted to do. But anyways, after Vincent, I would probably, uh, 
I don't know. What What would be our big bad? Uh, Nightmare. Nightmare would be the next one. Glitch Trap is there. And then Party Time is probably my all-time favorite. Because, like, you know, um, he, he uh, you know, he was a villain. He was, like, this machine that was made for evil and all that. Yada, yada, yada. Or he was a machine that was made evil. Yada, yada, yada. And then, like, um, you know, after spending a time suffering, and he came back as a good guy. So, you know, I always like redemption arcs. And the last question is for Golden Freddy. How does it feel to be an uncle? Yeah, it could be a bit of an asshole because I'm not really used to having kids. But, um, you know, it, it's, it's getting easier over time. I love my niece. Thanks, Uncle Goldie. No problem, sweetie. Okay, from uh, FNAF, uh, what made you want to become a plush tuber? Uh, the plush tuber multiverse thing that was going on in 2018 that didn't really get resolved, but whatever, whatever, whatever was going on with Fro with Finance at Froakies and the other plush tubers at the time. I don't, I don't know, but just more general influences like Travis, Froki, um, Mario Muffet Adventures was a really big one for me. So yeah. Uh, these next few come from A.W. Productions, or Austin W. Productions. Uh, when will you react to my vids? <laughs> How's life? Uh, life's been going good. I really should talk to you more on Discord. I, I've been really bad on doing that. I'm sorry. <laughs> Scrap Baby or Valora? Okay, I know that I, uh... I know you're watching this. Text me on Discord when you're watching this. And then I'll give you my answer. Anyways! And the last one from Mr. Bond just giving me some confetti. Kind of a short Q&A vid this time around, but I kind of like that. Just kind of just short Q&A vids and, you know, if I want to go bigger, grander or whatnot, then, you know, maybe I might do like a video doing this. But a nice short Q&A is just, uh, just, just what I need. But yeah, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, thank you guys so much for 6,000 subs. I... We are like 4,000 away from 10,000. I, I, I can't believe it. It's, it's, it's honestly really crazy. This like journey I've been on YouTube and how far I've gone. So I gotta really thank you guys so much. And yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.